Master table 8, we go with table 2. So what's your routine like on the road? Are you straight back to the hotel or are you being dragged away from the after party? Or are you a bit of both? Remember when we yeah. were in Denver? I do remember <laughs> when I was in Denver. That wasn't a structure. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Follow yeah. me out. But um, I am somebody who needs to sleep and, yeah. you know, I'm not a strong girl who can, like, mm -hmm. super power through. Right. Um, but I really enjoy meeting new people and yeah. I enjoy making the most of my time. I mean, I normally hit it quite hard, yeah. but um, I think I've managed to learn that. <laughs> <laughs> I've managed to sort of like gauge situations where they're not in and out gigs, but you know that it's like, right, this is a gig where yeah, it's a, I play and yeah. I'm sensible and go. There was a lot of like, there was this sort of last bit of touring we ever did with the band was, mm. was just sort of like, was just too much in a way. And I think that was part of me that really felt like the only way to, to actually sort of put the, that music out is to sort of be part of the process, you know? And then I think I've gained a little bit of wisdom recently. Yeah. So I'm a bit better at like you, that there are certain gigs where you feel like this is that you're here, you're here to do a job, but sometimes, yeah. I'm coming with the problem, yeah? Table nine, follow by, table eight, follow by, table two, follow by 17. Uh. All right, guys. What's good about the dance music scene industry at the moment? And what's bad? Okay. I quite like what the industry of dance is doing at the moment. I quite like all this sort of poppy animate stuff that's coming through the Friday nights mm -hmm. on Route 94 stuff. I think it's, mm -hmm. it's setting and sort of it's sort of setting a nicer sort of bar at which people make music than than when we were sort of really hitting at that EDM thing and I'm just getting worn out by that. So I'm sort of feeling pretty positive about it at the moment. Right? I kind of sometimes feel like I just want to sort of come up with a pseudonym and you know yeah. and see if I can sure. crank a couple out, you know, probably good for still got it in me. Yeah. 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 It seems to be a lot of people getting into it and that sort of can be a good thing in the sense that those people, you know, over time might get into slightly more underground music yeah. and yeah. so yeah. on and so on. So yeah. And it's nice that they can do that without like totally selling their soul. You know, I don't think yeah. uh, I don't think from Rude 94 Gorgons is he making horrible records. You know, mm -hmm. no, you don't have to make horrible records to be in the charts now, which is yeah. which is nice. You yeah. know, which was definitely not the case a few years ago. So Absolutely. that's that's really positive. Mm -hmm. Two fritto, one courgette flour. Oh, okay, the Thank you. Who's been the most influential person to you musically? Yeah. Amazingly well put together documentary about the whole Paradise Garage okay. and the loft and Damien yeah. Which is great, so, which is just, just a great story, isn't it? Yeah, yeah and it's yeah. like, I think before I, uh, I ever watched that, I was totally unaware of all of that. So it was a real educational yeah. thing. And off the back of that, I just, you know, like researched all the guys involved and all the music and went yeah. and just stemmed onto other things and yeah. mm. it was like a whole sort of like journey. Yeah. Um, in a weird way, because I grew up in Cambridge, it's such a sort of small town and we, so it's all those DJs who I grew up, because that was like Harvey and the Egypt Boys and so it was that whole disco thing was quite big. Mm. So I'm always conscious of them kind of listening to me DJ. I'm always thinking like, what would they think about what I'm playing now? And most of them, yeah, I don't even yeah, think, yeah, think very yeah, good yeah. things about it, you yeah, know? But, yeah. But it's kept me in check a little bit that, yeah. that they were because they were all heads. They're real heads. Yeah. Yeah. They were real like they're the ones that sort of kept me vaguely from getting too cheesy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Plus for me, it has to be something Chicago. Or I, bet. Detroit. Yeah. I mean, yeah, for sure. And but yeah, I mean, all those DJs, they they just they were writing the book yeah. in front of us, really. That's right. You yeah. know, yeah. they really were. Yeah. yeah. pizza, sandwich. Can we go? Hey guys, stand it up, well, the first vinyl you purchased, I mean, it's a simple one, can you remember it? The first vinyl I can remember was definitely, was definitely Thriller. Oh, was it? Yeah, I was really pleased out, and, and I took it home and, and, and I had something where my brother made me give it to him, I can't remember why, and <laughs> kind of got me in a headlock, you know, yeah. when I was listening to ACDC, and I'd put that on and go, no, that's really happening. I'm trying to remember, I mean, I, I just, I got into DJing, like, through the radio station, when I was a freshman right. in college, and, um... I just got so Perhaps. into it. It was like this like can of worms got opened yeah. and it was like I spent all of my lunch money kind of thing on records and mm. 30, 30 I, I bucks. I kept yeah. all the receipts for a year and like and then I went into the shop and I was like look I kept all the receipts like I've been buying records every week from me. Do you reckon you could just like give us a little bit of discount? <laughs> you know, and we just like no, sorry, and I was just like literally sorry, I was just sure. Sorry. I was just like, yeah, that's really good. Yeah, that's really good. And I kept yeah. all the receipts and yeah, then I was big, thinking that it would happen. And that's and cute. You're, yeah. like, you're like, I'm a big spender. Yeah, good yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm a big spender. 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 I